The Republican Party was established in 1854 to stop the steady expansion of slavery. It's called the Party of Abraham Lincoln, and we're proud of that. Because this man, born in a log cabin to barely literate parents, would save the soul of America and make all her people free. Lincoln was a born storyteller. He knew when to pause, when to hurry, when to stop. That fine storyteller turned out to be quite the warrior as well. He took office in March of 1861, when the United States did not seem so united. A friend observed, his work methods were neither swift nor brilliant, but for sure exhaustive. He was discouraged. Lack of progress early in the war. Agonizing over the more than 600,000 soldiers killed. He was pursuing a lonely and seeming impossible task. Preserving the Union. A burden our nation has never shouldered before or since. But Lincoln loved this country and respected the Constitution. He wrote a friend in Kentucky. It was in the oath that I would, to the best of my ability, preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States. I could not take the office without taking the oath. Nor was it my view that I might take an oath to get power and break the oath in using the power. At war's end, this man who had suffered, endured, and led, lost his life. But he had preserved the Union. He had saved the country. The country he had put first before self. <laughs>